everyone, Meissner here again. This time it's a trip video. Uh, I'm uh, going uh, with my friend uh, to East uh, Estonian roads and uh, let's see what uh, beautiful, what abandoned, what uh, places are on the road and uh, I hope you enjoy this view also. Come with me and uh, see what uh, beautiful Estonia is offering. Today I'm also uh, testing a new video equipment. My friend borrowed me a few Cobros and uh, let's see if the quality is better than the other one what I'm using. But uh, let's see.
we made it to the second place what I wanted to show them show you but uh, the first place uh, was um, 80s built uh, recreation center but uh, when we got there <laughs> only Scrabble was left because uh, it was demolished this year but uh, uh, right now we are at the uh, Vivigona village it's called uh, Estonian uh, Chernobyl because uh, uh, it was uh, how can I say it was built uh, for the Sillama workers uh, what is near here nine kilometers and uh, when it was built uh, in the 80s uh, there was uh, uh, 790 people living here but uh, right now uh, according to the 2007 uh, uh, data it's uh, only 90 people left and uh, it's no, quite abandoned I will show you So, what do you think about this place? <laughs> have, have, have you seen uh, such uh, abandoned places? Uh, every, uh, every, uh, how can I say? Else uh, in uh, Estonia? Nope. It looks pretty <laughs> abandoned for me. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's uh, no. uh, in the dark. It's uh, quite creepy here. I talked to my friend, and uh, he said that uh, when he was here last time. Uh, there was only a couple of uh, buildings, no, no can say lights on, but uh, when the uh, when he walked on this street also, uh, it was uh, only one uh, candle uh, lighting in the one of these buildings, and uh, it's uh, how can I say it's really creepy outside uh, when it's dark here, but uh, in the daylight, like you see. It's just abandoned buildings and uh, <laughs> I, do, I don't want to live here, it's creepy. But uh, right now we're taking a little break and uh, then uh, we're heading to the next place, what I want to show you. Uh, it's, uh, how can I say, a beautiful place. I hope you enjoy this. What I'm uh, showing you, uh, you should uh, also leave a comment. Uh, what is your uh, creepiest, uh, how can I say, village or town? Uh, what is in your uh, home area? And uh, let's compare them. Uh, let's uh, put a list uh, on the most uh, scariest uh, places in the world. But uh, now let's go on and let's see what's the next place.
we made it to the next place. Right now we are a place called uh, Doyle Harbour. It's a <laughs> very beautiful place. Uh, a very beautiful uh, scenery with the sea. And uh, let's uh, move and let's show you. next place it's so hot in outside that uh, I'm uh, melting 
<laughs> literally. And uh, this place is called uh, Wallas Stream. It's a, uh, how can I say, place uh, where, uh, I, d I don't know how to say it, uh, I'll just show it. <laughs> to the next place we are so exhausted uh, because uh, we've already driven 320 kilometers and uh, 100 kilometers to go <laughs> but uh, this uh, place is called uh, Isaku Watchtower it's uh, 28 uh, meters uh, high from its uh, place and the views are well, extraordinary but uh, in uh, uh, 20, 20, 2017 uh, the tower uh, was quite exhausted and uh, it uh, collapsed and uh, uh, what was it a year later uh, uh, the Isaku built a new watchtower and uh, I hope uh, this one stays a little bit longer because uh, it's newer but uh, now 
let's try to climb on it but <laughs> it's many many floors but let's start climbing <laughs> I need an elevator <laughs> We are so exhausted, <laughs> me extremely, because I'm wearing uh, full leather and it's not very cold outside. But the place where we are right now is 94 meters from the sea level and uh, the views are extremely beautiful. So, what are the impressions about climbing up here? I would give you 10 euros if you jump for the pine cone there. <laughs> uh, no, 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 no. Wanna be a flying squirrel? I don't want to die. <laughs> <laughs> but the history has said that one, one people has died in here, as you said. Uh, yeah, the, in uh, 2017, uh, before the tower collapsed, uh, one uh, woman jumped uh, from this uh, watchtower and uh, died. I don't know what are what were the causes, but uh, it's uh, very high from here. It's uh, imminent death, death if you uh, jump here. But uh, this is the last place for our sightseeing trip. Afterwards, it's uh, 100 kilometers uh, to home, and uh, I don't know, get some uh, gold to drink because <laughs> uh, we are so exhausted. But if you like this content, hit like, hit subscribe, and uh, I will uh, add some pictures what we took uh, when we were. Um, doing some off-roading and uh, gravel roads but uh, my camera doesn't uh, didn't uh, work that that time but uh, uh, hit subscribe and uh, time uh, let's uh, wait for the next content and uh, <laughs> I'm going home bye